Aloha, friends and family. This dude trying to violate our fucking rights, dude. This motherfucker better respect our fucking rights, bro. Woo! Some good looking motherfuckers right there. Yeah! Let's get some ribs and whiskey and rum. Get some coconuts and chop them up on the board. Let's go. Yeah! We're going fishing. Where's my fishing pole at? Elroy. Elroy, bring the dogs in. Bring the dogs. Good. Good. Damn chickens ran off. Moonshine, my moonshine jug. We got the horse up there. We're heading out. We got the guard dogs on watch. Everything's going good. I look excellent. I look extra exceptional today. Look at this attire here. That is one good looking mofo. So we had these vines that was on this papaya tree that was wild crafted. It just came out of nowhere. Papaya, beautiful, lush. It just seed dropped on the ground. And so actually we had to put, prop these rocks up on it because it, uh, it was slanted, it was bending. So the branches actually start over here. And it goes like that, it bends. There's no point in cutting it, really. It's kind of a little shade. Probably. I can put some rocks on that side like I did the other one. You know? They're going to grow quick. Yeah, yeah, they kind of do. Get some coconuts. Get out. Do something today.
Yeah. <laughs> that whole thing? You're talking about that piece right there? That one here. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I can probably get that. Just scratch it on the road. Yeah. Yeah, I can. Yeah. He's got, he's trying to chop these vines because these, uh, it looks like they're pretty invasive, whatever this is. I don't think it's poison ivy, Greg, luckily, because I would be getting poison ivy. And, uh, they look, there's a mimosa right there. It's, e it's eating up that mimosa. I think, oh wait, is this a mimosa? This whole tree is a mimosa. Holy cow. That's huge. It's huge, man. I am up in a mimosa. This is a really mature, big mimosa tree. All right, so let's jump down. One, two, God, and three. Whoa! That's a badass truck. Awesome shit. So now we got all of our new furniture in. Yeah. Salsa Rachera. Lord Costina, some chicken and fried rice, baby. Asians ain't got nothing on this dish. And here we go. This has got banana, coconut, almond, milk, and what else? There we go. Woo! That's some of that go go juice, baby. Bananas, grapes. Bites.
Yeah, we got to. Or at least put it over here to the side. Whoa, shit, thanks, bro. Is that all of it? Bro, you won't believe this shit. Straight up, man. Right down the street. Like, okay, we're just driving down the and we just stand up. And driving, like, it just keeps going and going. It's got, like, scary. Cause the sun was going down. And I'm like, I'm just going to drive. And I swear to fuck. I, I didn't have my phone on me, too. I was like, God damn it. I could have taken pictures of this shit. There are peyote cactuses just lined up through this road. I was like, is that? It's lunch. For like, God fucking sakes. Well, that's fucking the peyote. Bro. They're just Thank you. All, and a beautiful lined up. And then there was your first pieces that were cut off. So I was like, oh, fuck yeah. And I, I gotta go back to this motherfucker. You just take a slice off and fucking fuck shit all the way up. And you're ready to fucking roll, ain't you? I have these San Pedros for their mescaline. There was a group of students in the ayahuasca tradition, but they're also very big into the Tibetan Buddhist tradition, and they brought their Buddhist master, they brought him to an ayahuasca ceremony, and they asked him the next day what, what he thought of the drug, quote unquote. And he said, that's not a drug, that's a food. 